Good morning, babe. Good morning, you guys. Uh, <laughs> I didn't know Mother was going to put me on the spot right now. Yeah, yeah. Good morning, guys. Welcome to another Vlogmas Day 5000. I'm 5, just kidding. <laughs> Yo, we are on it. We're on a roll. And today we bring you something that you guys, been, you guys have been asking us for, right? Yeah, it's something that I was very iffy about posting because... Um, I don't consider ourselves like workout gurus. I don't consider ourselves like fitness trainers, none of that. And in the past, I told Mando, you know, sometimes people are very, Excuse yes, me. when it comes to like, <laughs> oh my God, your set is wrong or whatever in the workout community, yep. unfortunately. But you guys have been asking so much. So we were like, let's do it. Perfect timing right now that we need to put out all these vlogs. Get my skin out. Let's do it. So today we are bringing you our workout routine and talking to you guys on the way there, just giving you guys like little tips and what we eat and what we don't eat. And then once we get to the gym, I'm gonna show you guys like a little workout routine. What are we doing today, anyways? I think we should do legs. You know, go ham today. Show them like the that's like our toughest workout. So we might as well go hard or go home. Yes, I agree. Let's do it. Let's All right. Do it. So stay with us if you want to see our workout routine and happy vlog. All right, you guys, we're back. <laughs> All right, you guys, so quick little recap of our whole, like, when we started, um, how much we've lost, which I know is the number dun, dun, one dun. question. The number one question we get is, how much weight have we lost? How much weight specifically has Mondo lost? And what is your overall goal? All righty, all righty, all right. So you guys know my overall goal was 30 pounds. Um, Pretty much to get ready for 2022 with possibly a wedding, possibly a lot of partying, I didn't even think about you know, that. just possibly a lot of things going on in 2022. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna hit it hard for six months and try to get to this goal. And I'm literally, guys, five pounds away. Like yeah. I'm not kidding you. And I feel like wait, wait, great. you haven't said how many pounds? Pero me pa ya oh. voy. All right, I am 25 pounds down. Yay. And um, <laughs> and I think look. I'm going to be honest with y'all. That kind of motivated me to cut my barba off. Just because, te imaginas, I would have had a papada like this, 25 pounds heavier. And then when I gained weight, I gained it in my face too, right? Yeah, which I didn't even notice until the other day we were watching um, like older vlogs. And we were like, dang. <laughs> I look inflado, guys. Like, But yeah. I have lost around 11 or 12 pounds. Um, And the last time we checked, whenever we... First started and said, okay, vamos a poner en las pilas is actually whenever Blanca and Jonathan oh, came yeah. that we said, okay, um, let's do this challenge, which didn't happen because Blanca got Ay, pregnant. Blanca. We're so <laughs> but um, yeah, that's when we started, which was back in May, right mm -hmm. after my birthday, right after Lily Fest. Um, that is when we were like at our now I would say like max weight. Yeah, I think not so. Ma for me, not max weight ever. Oh, but that's true. That's when we like looked at it and we were like, okay, let's lose weight, right? Yeah, that's when I said, okay, I, let's put in those las pilas. At least me, because I was literally getting to like my heaviest. Okay, so now let's just tell you guys our lifestyle, some of our tips. You know what we got going on. What are we doing? Um, have we always been doing it? How long did it take us to get to this point? You know, and whatnot. Do you want to tell them a little yeah, bit? Yeah, um, I want to. I want to give you my number one like top three tips. Um, number one is always eating healthy or as healthy as you can. I mean, sometimes we have like weekend parties and things like that. So those cheat meals are not horrible. But as long as you jump back on like Monday, you know, get back on your diet, on your healthy lifestyle eating, that's number one. Number two is eating the right amount of calories. That's like number two, like number one and number two right there. Like you have to eat the right amount of calories. You can't starve yourself. Like Because Mando used to actually eat very little yeah. very very little and i would tell him babe like we're working out we're, and then you're burning this fat and then you're not like he he wouldn't really see like a change in the scale and i would tell him like i feel like your body is literally like holding on to its food yeah. because he would eat the same amount as me for somebody the size of mando um you have to eat more you know um and it, i know it sounds crazy but i would tell him tell him tell him babe 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 you gotta eat more you gotta eat more you know 
And I feel like then you will see drastic results. And so yeah, I um I ate more, which is that's like number one, number two, and last but not least, which is um working out. And it came out like it, it, like as soon as he started eating more, yeah. like it was just like dropping yeah. like crazy. And even though we are like we try to be strict at home. Like, if our friends are like, hey, let's go have a drink, or hey, well, to me, right? Or hey, let's go, um, let's go to brunch, or let's go to dinner. Like, we're down. We go, yeah. um, before I would say no, right? I, yeah. I was always like, nah, 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 die, 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 die. But I just didn't want to live that way. I, I just didn't want, we just didn't want to live that way, like, that strict. Um, we came to an all moment, like, dang, you know, like, we're young right now. Like, if our friends are inviting us out, like, right now that we have the energy to do it, like, let's go do it, you know? Yeah, when we get back home or, you know, we'll, we'll be strict again or, yeah, tomorrow we'll go work out, you know, it's another day. But for me, I would say don't be so hard on yourselves, like, if you are trying to go through this journey journey lifestyle change whatever don't be too hard on yourself take it easy you know like if you mess up like we did for this past week it's okay you can start again yeah. pretty much what she's trying to say make this a lifestyle change like mm -hmm. make this part of your life don't like do like a two week one month diet just make it like a lifestyle change try to eat healthy go to the gym eat the right amount of calories and um you know just make it lifestyle always jump back on it though oh, yeah. always i have a bonus tip what um, find somebody to hold you accountable. Like, like for example, uh, get a friend, a sister, a cousin. I don't know. Do this with someone. It's not. It's not like mandatory. But if you find somebody to hold you accountable, someone to be like, hey, hey, bacala tu pedo, or something like that, it, it works out. Cause um, for sure, something else that I'm very proud of Mando about is the fact that before he would make excuses to not go work out at night. And now what? Now I don't make any excuses. I'm like, yeah. all right, give me a Celsius and let's get like it. Like he just tries to push through it. Like even though he, he'll be super tired because he wakes up like at five every day. So I understand, but I feel like once you get into the gym, like yeah. you'll be fine. Yeah. Just get yourself to the gym and that's it, you know? So another tool that I use is IIFYM.com. It's basically a macro calculator that helps you cut like it helps you be more specific as to how many carbs, lipids, and protein you specifically need for your body type. And what I do is I take those results and I will edit them into my Fitness Pal app under the settings. And then from there, um, you'll know how many to eat on your daily. I do not want to do this. What are we doing? I thought we were going to go work out. I forgot to insert our pictures of our biggest wait which okay? one are we inserting literally the biggest ever the biggest ever. Right, i'm down <laughs> i think i was like 265 270 Alla madre. No pasa nada, guys. but yeah my biggest was like 2012 13 somewhere around there i can't remember exactly but i'm gonna insert a picture right here it's crazy right <laughs> all right your turn so yeah, I, my biggest was 180, Sheesh. almost 180. It was like 170 something, and I'ma insert picture. that picture. <laughs> insert that picture <laughs> right. I don't want to do it. Right, I don't do it. right here. Sheesh. I know, I know. But yeah, I mean that that's just it's just motivation. Keep going, keep going, ham. You could do it, guys. Let's do it. Let's do you it. could do it. Lifestyle changes. Little by little. You don't don't compare yourself. Just yeah, start don't today. In less than a year, I gained that much weight. That was when I was about 20 years old. And fast forward until barely like a few months ago which I kind of already knew, but I had never gone to an actual doctor to figure it out. But apparently, thyroid issues run in my dad's side of the family, and my prima told me, yeah, that is an actual thing in our family. Um, My primas and my tias take medication for that every day. So right now, literally, when did I go? Like two days? Yesterday? Yeah. Yesterday, I went to the doctor again because I'm always, like, messing up, right? But, um, yeah, they think I have thyroid issues. They're still trying to figure it out. I'm doing blood work. They got me on medicine to see, like, if it helps. I don't know what, you know, all these terms, right? Um, so, yeah, apparently, I might have a thyroid issue, which makes sense as to why it's so hard for me to lose weight because, as Mando, 
how strict am I? Even more so yeah, compared super, to how strict you are. Super strict compared to me. I mean, I cheat more than she does in terms of food. Um, but yeah, she's like by the book for the most part. It doesn't make me lose any motivation at all. I just do it little at a time. I don't compare yeah. myself like, oh, I've only lost this much since May and Mando has lost freaking a million pounds. You know, no, I don't. I, I know my body already. Like, I don't mind. Like, a little bit at a time, no pasa nada, you know? Yeah, but at the end of the day, we're on our own journey. And you can't be comparing, like, me to someone else and yourself to someone else. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Do your thing. Do um, what you got to do. Stay motivated. Stay motivated. All right, enough talk. Let's go get to the gym. Insert... Um, Insert a hype workout video right here. All right, ahora sí, vámonos, vámonos. <laughs> I'm gonna her out. You ready? <laughs> she put her tights, or what do they call it? Sweatpants, upside down, the wrong way, backwards. I got it, I got it. All right, ahora sí, vámonos, vámonos. <laughs> vámonos, vámonos, vámonos. All right, you guys, <laughs> we're done. Honestly, I haven't been able to bail prep like that lately. So you guys are gonna see what we get right now. <laughs> Damn, this looks good. I mean, what you got, babe? So I got half and half, half rice, because they do give a lot of rice and the other half kale, and then chicken and broccoli. And I got a small bowl because smaller portions. Y todavía no me voy a acabar todo And I got rice, kale, um, some broccoli and some teriyaki chicken. All right, you guys, let's eat. See you guys later. But yeah, that's it on today's Vlogmas. Mm -hmm. We hope you guys enjoyed, like always. Uh, make sure you comment, make sure you are subscribed, and make sure you hit that like button. You already know. See, See you, you guys, guys on, on the, the next Vlogmas. Vlogmas. Bye. Bye.